Hey, my name's Natasha. You're watching Something About Movies, and this is my review for Zookeeper. So Zookeeper stars Kevin James, Rosario Dawson, and Leslie Bibb in a pretty typical love triangle premise, but to make it really interesting, let's add talking animals. So Kevin James plays a zookeeper who's thinking about quitting his job because his ex-girlfriend is back in the picture, and she doesn't want to be with him unless he gets a job making more money. And the animals in the zoo hear about this, and they think that the best way to keep Kevin James working at the zoo is to teach him how to attract his ex-girlfriend by using different tricks that animals use in the wild. And as long as he gets his girlfriend, he's not going to have to leave his job at the zoo. Meanwhile, you've got Rosario Dawson's character, who is a fellow zookeeper and has kind of like a secret crush on Kevin James and somehow ends up helping him try to get his ex-girlfriend back. This movie started out okay, and I was hopeful. I thought it could be going somewhere. But as soon as the animals started talking, I was like, no, you lost me. The animals just came off as really dumb. Like, it's okay if one or two of them have that buffoon quality, but when all of them do, it's just a bit, it's a bit too much for me. And there was a lot of physical comedy in this movie, like slapstick humor, and it's okay when it's in its place, but when it's every three minutes or so, the movie just starts to feel repetitive. You can only watch Kevin James fall down so many times before it stops being funny. So my biggest problem with the story is that right from the beginning you get this idea that Kevin James's ex-girlfriend was really only interested in status and money and Kevin James was more interested in happiness and doing what he likes. And so I don't understand how these animals would think that by him getting this girl, he would want to stay at the zoo. I mean, the whole reason the girl left him in the first place is because he worked at the zoo. I mean, it just doesn't add up to me. So right from the get-go, you already can tell that this is a pretty predictable plot and kind of a self-fulfilling storyline. As far as genre goes, it has this really weird mix of childish humor and adult storyline that really doesn't appeal to anyone. Uh, by the second half of this movie, the children were getting restless because the animals weren't really in it anymore, and the adults weren't really invested because the storyline was just so stupid. My biggest issue with this movie is pretty early on, uh, it's established that Rosario Dawson's character is kind of passing up an incredible opportunity to work at the Nairobi Zoo in Africa because she wants to stay near Kevin James in the hope that he would want to be with her. I mean, seriously? Kevin James, career opportunity you've probably been working for your entire life. It might have been believable if he had had a body of a Greek god, or maybe like a great personality or something, but throughout the entire movie he kind of acts like a big douchebag and treats Rosario Dawson as a wingman. Not cool. So I'm going to give this movie a 1.5 out of 4 stars. It was... it was okay, but there are just so many problems with the storyline, and I really didn't like the way they portrayed the animals, so yeah. Yeah. So the question that comes to my mind after seeing this movie is what is the biggest thing you've ever given up for your significant other? Let me know in the comments below or in a video response.